Hi everybody, welcome to Matt Bayeski YouTube channel. Um, okay, uh, thank you so much for the downloading of the beautiful music, which are which is 13 hours, um, spirit trapped in between two worlds. It will help them move into the light. Now, how many messages have we had about the music? Okay, so I'm gonna, I knew this would happen uh, because there's so many aspects of this music that is gonna kind of like throw everybody here and there. The first question was asked, can I use this music without saging because it's a challenge to sage where I live and in the house because of other uh, 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 issues and problems? Yes, you can use it and it will work really, really well. How that works without the sage, I don't know. But I do know that the music is absolutely perfect for helping spirit trapped in between two worlds and it's absolutely beautiful to bring peace balance and harmony into the house second question mark if there is no negative energy in the house i.e spirit trapped in between two worlds if i play this music will it encourage spirit trapped in between two worlds to come to my house does not work like that it doesn't work like that. Spirit trapped in between two worlds rarely comes into a house. Spirit trapped in between two worlds is because wherever they've passed, they were in that energy there and they stay there and that's it until, because they're in denial. So you'll often see when you've watched um, haunting programs or you've ever heard people say that at 12 midnight, there's a woman who walks at the same time. That's because they're stuck in this energy of denial. So they keep doing the same thing repetitive. So you cannot encourage spirit trapped in between two worlds, nor can you encourage any dark and negative entities because this music is absolutely it's like a foghorn it's like a wake up or it's a siren and and, and it, like shh, anything dark will disappear because of the vibration the energy plus embedded into that music is 13 hours of me sat down speaking to spirit so it, not talking out loud, but speaking in this beautiful spiritual sense of what I've learned over these 13 years. So, anyway, we come to the point where we say, um, and this may happen as well, so it's good to know that, that there may be noises in the house when you're playing in the music. That is because the energy in the house is changing. So a wood could crack more, things can happen. That's normal, nothing negative, nothing dark. It is a cleansing and clearing of the house. So things can happen, things can move, things can drop. Now, there is one point that I wanted to discuss with you that sometimes we don't even know that there is spirit trapped in between two worlds in that house. As soon as you put the music on, you might realize, wow, something's happening and I didn't know. So not everybody is as sensitive to understanding that spirit is in the house. You might not, you might never have known, but as soon as the music starts playing, it can seem as though you think, oh my God, something's come. No, something was already there. What we're doing now is we're bringing it to the surface. We see it and now it's gonna go. So that's another thing. The next thing I wanna talk about is the vibration after the 13 hours. Um, if you are living in a, a dense energy and you place this music on, all of a sudden that dense energy disappears. So now you're on a vibration which is very, very um, light. Um, so let me explain in this way. This is the only way I can explain, right? This is you, this is the spirit world. When you play the music, what happens is the vibration of that house goes like this. And spirit comes down to that level. So now you can connect. So what may happen is that you might have more of a connection to your family in the spirit world feeling around you and you might feel happier. Oh, because there's many a times that spirit comes into a room and, and it's beautiful so beautiful you feel like oh i feel so good and sometimes that spirit brushing past you or moving through you <gasps> i feel really good and you know people do, why did i just feel good for no reason well sometimes spirit has that gift of of that it's a memory of where you come from and where you come from is pure bliss 
It's really hard to describe this and for anybody to truly understand unless you've moved into the spirit world and come back. Many people have died and, and have said the same thing that I've connected to, which is the word, um, the, um, I think many different cultures use it on the, the, the spiritual uh, meaning of Nirvana. So it's connecting to the highest energy, which I believe is the spirit world. Call it what you want, but it feels like the spirit world. To connect to the spirit world means that they're next to you or, or connected to you or, or feeling you. So, wow, I just feel really good for no reason. Well, maybe because spirit's in the room. Therefore, this music, when you play it, it, it allows spirit to come into the room easier. So one of the things that shamans know, and, and, and if you're a real healer and you know your job, you've got to create the right space, okay? So that means you've got to clear the energy in the room. You use um, different kinds of uh, sage or Paolo Santo sticks like I use, and then you're creating a, a better energy in that, that room. You're playing beautiful music, which is raising the vibration, and then all of a sudden, you can do your work much easier. So you pull in the universal energy through you much easier. Spirit comes through you much easier. I speak about this on the Four Day Pure Energy Healing course. There's some, the, if I start talking like this, I can go down into so many paths and so much detail that I could be talking all day. But suffice to say, this music cannot and will never cause any negative energy it's all about purification love light and absolute inner peace and joy and like i said yesterday somebody used this uh, music two days ago and i really wanted to know what they felt because it's so important for me to know feedback and they said mark after playing it for 13 hours all i can tell you is the next morning the word i got was freedom and that's enough for me. That tells me everything. Freedom is a, is a beautiful expression of peace and, and nothingness, emptiness. But that emptiness is exactly what you're after. So you're not filled with negative energy, negative thoughts, negative fear, fear, fear. Your emptiness in that space is where you're meant to be. That's who you are. That's where you come from because it is a nothingness which is everything. So I am nothing, I am everything. You know, this is nothing, but it's everything. So it's not filled with negative energy, negative anger, people fighting in the room, screaming in the room. When you play this music, it also helps clear that energy, it breaks it down. So, so yes, you can use it even if you haven't got spirit trapped in between two worlds. But again, there's a flip side to that coin that you might have had spirit in that house and didn't know. And you know what? Anytime you can help move spirit into the light, that's a beautiful thing. So I sat for 13 hours. So in on this, on this beautiful piece of music, which is absolute perfect pitch and sound, and it goes on for 13 hours, I sat on one session and did a whole session as I would do if I was connecting to spirit and helping them move back into the light because they didn't even know that they had died because it's called spirit in denial. Denial means they didn't even know or whatever had happened just before they died, they went through a lot of trauma and they didn't move to, to home. So I help them and so what happens is I work from the first moment of speaking to spirit and helping them and guiding them back home and that is repeated for 13 hours. So it, it really is beautiful because even though you can't hear me speak it's embedded into the music that's how clever this is and that's why I say it's very special so even if you just play it and you don't even need to play it loud just doesn't matter it's not about the the, the high vibration loudness it's just just a nice like this just nice It fills the room, it fills the room, it fills the house, and it frees and heals. I think that's it. I think that's answered uh, some of your questions. Um, I'll keep this around 10 minutes. If you have any more questions to ask, then please do. But you know what? I want to leave you on this note. For a decade and a half, people used to come to my room and desperately want to tell me their problems because they believed that if they didn't give me all the pieces to their issues and problems, I wouldn't be able to help them. 
The first thing I used to do to everybody who came into my room is this. Zip it. Say nothing. Because we don't need though that information. A good healer doesn't need it. They feel what needs to be done within the body. And they heal them. And that's it. You give them a cuddle and they've gone. And that's it. And you earn a reputation of, my, he didn't even know what was wrong. But I feel amazing. Or he didn't even want to know anything. And he told me everything. That's what's called a true seer. Somebody who really does the work. That is what I've done for all of these years. And I've put all of that effort, all of that understanding, all of that wisdom in how to help spirit move home. And that's why this beautiful 13 hours of music is what I believe is going to really make the difference. And I really hope it helps. So from my heart to your heart, if it feels right, if it feels like you want it, then trust that gut feeling. If you have no feeling at all about it and it's not, and you don't, I don't need it, then that's perfect because it means you didn't need it and, that, and you're listening to you. But if you feel a pull, then that's normally the answer. That's the same with my website. You go, you look at the crystals, you look at the oils, the incense. I like that. Well, you trust your feeling. I walk into an art gallery, I look at a thousand pictures and one of them I feel pulled to, well, I know that's the one. And th thus, the picture, the crystal, the oils, the music always calls to you. And that is what you need to trust. That is your part of doing the work, trusting in your gut feeling. Forget about the questions, just do it for you and trust in you. That's my message today. Have a great day till tomorrow. Take care.